Imagine an element so elusive it's yet to be fully discovered. This is ununenium, or element 119. Ununenium is a bit like a ghost in the world of chemistry. It's a hypothetical alkali metal predicted to be the lightest element in the eighth period of the periodic table. This is like saying it's expected to be a new kid on the block, joining the ranks of well-known elements like hydrogen, lithium, and sodium. But as of now, it's still in the realm of theory, waiting to be confirmed. Why is it so hard to find, you might ask? Well, ununenium doesn't exist naturally. Scientists have been trying to create it in labs since 2018. The main stage for these attempts has been Japan, where dedicated teams have been working tirelessly to bring this elusive element to life, and the race is heating up with upcoming attempts planned in Russia and China. It's a global effort, a testament to the relentless pursuit of knowledge that defines the scientific community. But what makes ununenium so fascinating? It's not just its elusive nature, it's the properties that this element is expected to have. You see, ununenium's properties are predicted to be influenced by something called relativistic effects. This could lead to some unique and interesting behavior. For example, it's expected to show oxidation states of plus one, plus three, and plus five. To put it in simpler terms, ununenium could interact with other elements in ways we've never seen before. This could open up new doors in our understanding of chemistry and the universe itself. Ununenium's properties, influenced by relativistic effects, could lead to unique behavior such as exhibiting oxidation states of plus one, plus three, and plus five. The creation of super-heavy elements like ununenium is a complex process. It involves the fusion of two nuclei. We're delving right into the heart of the matter. The synthesis of super-heavy nuclei, including the hypothetical element ununenium, relies on nuclear reactions. This process can be likened to a grand cosmic dance, where two atomic nuclei come together, merging into one. This fusion is no small feat. The two nuclei are both positively charged and like charges, repel each other. So, overcoming this repulsion to allow the nuclei to come close enough to fuse is a challenge. But with enough speed and perfectly aligned conditions, they can overcome this barrier and merge. Once the fusion occurs, we don't immediately have our new super-heavy nucleus. This newborn nucleus is typically in an excited state, with an excess of energy. It needs to cool down, and it does this through a process called neutron emission. This is where it emits neutrons, reducing its energy until it reaches a stable state. But how do we know if we've successfully created a new super-heavy element like ununenium? That's where decay and detection processes come into play. Super-heavy nuclei primarily decay through two processes, alpha decay and spontaneous fission. In alpha decay, the nucleus emits an alpha particle, which is essentially a helium nucleus. On the other hand, spontaneous fission involves the nucleus splitting into two smaller nuclei. Detecting these decay products allows scientists to confirm the creation of a new element. The decay patterns are like fingerprints, unique to each element. By studying these patterns we can confirm if we've indeed synthesized a new super-heavy element. These super-heavy nuclei primarily decay through alpha decay and spontaneous fission. So, the process of creating and detecting super-heavy elements is a fascinating journey, one that takes us to the very limits of our understanding of the atomic world. It's a journey that is still ongoing with many exciting discoveries yet to come. There's a fascinating concept in the world of super-heavy elements, the island of stability. This intriguing idea revolves around the prediction that there exists a region in the chart of nuclides, where super-heavy elements, like ununenium, could display increased stability compared to their neighbors. The term island is quite apt here, as this zone of stability is surrounded by a sea of less stable elements. Now what makes this island so special? It's all about the magic number of nucleons, which is predicted to be around 300. Nucleons are the particles found in an atom's nucleus, namely protons and neutrons. The magic number is a specific number of nucleons that create complete shells within the nucleus. This shell completion results in a much more stable nucleus, hence the term magic. In the context of ununenium, this is particularly significant. As the lightest element in the eighth period of the periodic table, ununenium is expected to exhibit certain unique behaviors due to relativistic effects. These include showing oxidation states of plus one, plus three, and plus five. However, these behaviors are just predictions at this point, as ununenium is yet to be synthesized successfully. The island of stability is not just a theoretical curiosity. It has major implications for our understanding of atomic structure and nuclear physics. 
It could also lead to the discovery of new, super heavy elements with unexpected properties which could open up new avenues in science and technology. As we delve deeper into the world of super heavy elements, the Island of Stability continues to be a guiding beacon. It stands as a testament to the incredible intricacy and beauty of the atomic world, and the endless possibilities it holds. Experimental evidence has shown the importance of shell effects in determining the stability of super-heavy nuclei. So, why all this fuss about ununenium, a yet undiscovered element, you might be asking? Well, the successful synthesis of ununenium could potentially open a whole new world of scientific advancements and benefits. We're not just talking about another element to add to the periodic table. No, we're talking about an element that could fundamentally transform our understanding of the periodic table and the very nature of elements themselves. Ununenium, if discovered, is expected to be the lightest element in the eighth period of the periodic table. And this alone makes it an object of intense scientific curiosity. Its properties are predicted to be influenced by relativistic effects, which could lead to unique behavior, such as showing oxidation states of plus 1, plus 3, and plus 5. This could potentially challenge our existing knowledge of elemental properties and open up new avenues of research and application. The synthesis of super-heavy nuclei like ununenium involves the fusion of two nuclei through nuclear reactions, followed by decay and detection processes to confirm the creation of a new element. This intricate process is not only a testament to human ingenuity, but also a potential goldmine for scientific discovery. It's also important to note that super-heavy nuclei, including ununenium, are primarily observed to decay through alpha decay and spontaneous fission. This means that the discovery of ununenium could provide us with valuable insights into these decay processes, potentially leading to advancements in nuclear technology. Moreover, the ongoing attempts to synthesize ununenium are a testament to international scientific collaboration with efforts underway in Japan and future attempts planned in Russia and China. The discovery of ununenium could therefore not only rewrite our understanding of elements but also foster international cooperation in the scientific community. Lastly, the synthesis of ununenium could potentially lead us to the Island of Stability a theoretical region of the periodic table where super-heavy elements exhibit increased stability. This could revolutionize our understanding of super-heavy elements and potentially lead to the discovery of even heavier stable elements. The discovery of ununenium could rewrite the way we understand elements and their properties. And that, in essence, is why the scientific community is so excited about the potential discovery of ununenium. It's more than just another element. It's a key new understanding of our universe. Ununenium, a potential game changer in the world of chemistry, remains a fascinating subject of study. In the grand scheme of scientific exploration, this hypothetical alkali metal known as element 119 is expected to be the lightest element in the eighth period of the periodic table. The ongoing attempts to synthesize ununenium since 2018 in Japan, with future efforts being planned in Russia and China, are a testament to the relentless pursuit of knowledge and understanding in the scientific community. The predicted properties of ununenium, influenced by relativistic effects, suggest unique behavior like showing oxidation states of plus 1, plus 3, and plus 5. The process of synthesizing super-heavy nuclei, such as ununenium, involves the fusion of two nuclei through nuclear reactions. These processes are followed by subsequent decay and detection processes to confirm the creation of a new element. The theory of an island of stability for nuclei with around 300 nucleons is one that has piqued interest and continues to drive research in this field. We thank the contributors to this Wikipedia article for their comprehensive information on ununenium. The link is listed in the description and we urge you to click on it to see the full articles and their illustrations. Please click on the link in the description that leads you to our Amazon and other affiliates website page for making your everyday purchases. Please like, subscribe, share, and click on the notification bell. And thank you very much for those who have already decided to subscribe to our channel.